We only care what the, what's in, 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 in between the lines, man. In between in these pages, man. These covers of these pages. That's what we care about. You know? That's what we care about, man. Pushing this truth that the elect here and we, and we wake up, man. You know? I'm trying to endure. Uh, let's see here what it says. Matthew 24 and 13. It says, but he that shall endure until the end, same shall be saved. And, that's, and that's, that's the goal, man. We're trying to endure. That's why we constantly pray to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Keep his spirit on us, man. You know, we need him to, we need him to defeat Esau, man. We need him, man. We need him, his spirit to be on us right now to just keep putting up with with this 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 ways of this world man we need it man and he that endure to the end you're gonna be saved from what the thermonuclear destruction that's coming because Yahweh Bashem Yahushai is getting ready to, to actually bring that destruction also man he tells you that right here in uh I think I'm the same chapter I want to say Uh, Matthew 24 and 36 but of that day and hour knoweth no man no not the angels of heaven but the father only and that day is the day of the destruction the day that that, that the thermonuclear destruction is gonna have that 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 go Yahweh Shai don't even know the date it said only only the father Yahweh knows that day when he gonna get that green light to his son and the angels but as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of man be, because it was sudden. People were into their wickedness. They were doing what they wanted to. And Noah was a righteous man preaching to them the same way we're preaching to the people now. Noah was a, a preacher of righteousness, man. And they looked at him like he was, they, they looked at him like he was a fool. Because why? Because when you read in the uh, second chapter of Genesis, back then it never rained. Only the mist came on the ground. He, he told them it was going to rain. So he looked at him like a fool too. And we're telling you that there's going to be thermonuclear destruction. Thus said the Lord, a fire is coming. Right? Let me show you. A fire is coming. Right? A fire is coming. Second Peter 3 and 10. The Lord is not slack concerning his promise. He's not slack concerning his promise that he gave to the Israelites. He's not slack. It says, as some men count slackness, because a lot of men have fell out this truth, man. They heard the good word, hey, and, and, and the Lord ain't moving fast enough for them. Because if we read up, it said one day of the Lord is a thousand years. And a thousand years is to him one day. So the Lord is not moving fast enough for a lot of these people. Right, so they they they, they count uh, uh, slackness, so they, they fall out the truth. But it's long suffering to us word, right? So his word not gonna go out void, right? It says, not willing that any should perish, but they all should come to repentance. Who he's talking about right here? The elect, the elect are the ones that's gonna basically stick with this man. He's gonna put the spirit on the elect to what endure. And it says, because it's all prophecy. It said he didn't endure to the end, gonna be saved. So, and, so, and he gonna have a spirit on the elect to endure, man. These are prophecies, man. And it says, but the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night. That day of the Lord, that day of that thermonuclear destruction, is gonna come like a thief in the night. And a thief comes when you are not aware. He catches you off guard. Just like in the days of Noah, man. They were eating and drinking and married and they got caught off guard and it started raining. And the angel shut that ark door. 
and we're, we're getting close to that time where, the, where the, this spiritual art door is getting ready to shut. Because you see now they're trying to uh, ban certain things that you see on YouTube. If you don't have so many subscribers, you can't put videos up. Or if you put certain content up, they'll, they'll take videos down. So they're they're going into that they're going into that uh, uh, stage where the family of the word is, you know, the Lord is going to allow Esau to cut the internet off, man. And that's going to be the prophecy in Amos eight and eleven, the famine of hearing the words, man. You know, it says, "But thou should come to repentance, but the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night." in which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, man. And you have, you have, uh, 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 this is the first heaven, you have the second heaven, and you have the spiritual world, heaven. This first heaven is gonna pass away with a great noise, man. It's certain, it, the America, it's all America is gonna be hit by a great noise of thermonuclear destruction, the ICBM intercontinental ballistic missiles, man, which the Lord has allowed the, these, uh, these are uh, Edomites to create in the in the labs. And they call themselves scientists. They have created these these uh, thermonuclear uh, missiles. Which, when you read in Isaiah 54, it tells you that these the Lord has created the waster to destroy. It, right? He burned the fire in the coals, man. He put the put the. Uh, Metal in the in the coal that black oak goes into describing how the ancient blacksmiths fine tuned metal, which the ancient blacksmiths are the today's modern scientists, the men of Tina. Right? And it says, and it says, but the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. The earth and also the works therein shall be burned up. Burned up by what? These missiles, man. They're gonna be burned up by the thermonuclear missiles. And it's not talking about the whole earth. Because when you read in Ecclesiastes, the first chapter tells you that the earth buys forever. It's just the, the, the place of America, the place that has that has uh this filthy uh, filth, uh, filth of wickedness, man. The place that has no more no more uh, uh, stability, no more character. The place where you have uh, uh, the new Sodom and Gomorrah. This is America. This is the place that's going to be destroyed. The whole system, this Roman system that America uh, runs and it predicates itself on, is going to be destroyed, man, by the Heavenly Father, which He has had the same people creating the weapons that's going to destroy you. This is a this is an instrument of His work in Isaiah 54. You know. It says, the, the elements, uh, it says, the elements gonna melt with fervent heat. So that's letting you know everything over here is basically gonna be burnt down because everything you see in America is, is made up of elements, man. It's made up of elements. The concrete, the trees, the people, the buildings, everything is element. It said all the elements shall melt with fervent heat. And it's gonna be a beautiful day. The day of Jacob's trouble. Hey man, it's gonna be beautiful, man. It's gonna catch you off guard. And it says, seeing that, seeing then that all these things shall 